Okay, today we'll learn Mathematics Part 1, Standard 10, Practice Set 3.4. Okay. Three point four page number seventy. But don't forget to solve solved examples. They are also important. Okay. See so this important. Okay. Important. Okay. Don't forget to solve. Okay, first problem. Sanika decided to save 10 rupees, 11 rupees, go on like this. Okay. Sanika saving 10, 11, 12. Okay. Now this is an AP. Okay, this is AP. Because common difference is 1, 1, 1, common difference is 1. That's why A is equal to 10. And D is equal to 11 minus 10, 1. Okay. But N we don't know. N is, we don't know. That you have to find it from here. Okay. That got 2016. Okay. 2016. Okay. Say so last two digit, okay. Last two digit is divisible by four. Therefore, leap year. Therefore, three sixty sixteen. Okay. So n is equal to three sixty six. Okay. Now we want to find H366 is question mark. That you have to put the formula Hn is equal to n by 2, 2a plus n minus 1 into d. Now we want this H366 is equal to n is 366 upon 2, 2 into a is 10 plus this 366 minus 1 into d is 1. That you calculate 366. 20 plus 365. Okay. And you can cut this also. 2 into 1. So 183 into 385. Okay. Try to calculate here somewhere. So seven zero four five five rupees. This is the answer for first. Please calculate. It is very big. Okay. So he borrowed eight thousand. Interest is one three six zero. Okay. So we'll first calculate how much is that. Okay. We will add it, okay.
Okay. So N F twelve it is given. N F twelve we got F twelve. We want to find each installment is less than preceding one less. Okay. Mean less than rupees forty less. Each installment, okay, each. Each is less than rupees, okay. So that's why we have to take therefore d is minus forty, okay, minus forty, because it is less, okay, minus forty. What do you want to find? We want to find a is question mark, and last t to t to a is question mark. That is first and Last installment. Okay, that we want to find it. Okay, first and last installment. Okay, now we can write the formula and solve it. Okay, now we have the formula. S n is equal to n by two to a plus n minus one d. Okay. So it is twelve. Okay, n is twelve. So s twelve is equal to twelve by two, two into eight. We don't know. We want to find d plus n is twelve minus one, and d is minus forty. Okay. S twelve is given nine three six zero nine three six zero. You cut it. It is equal to six into two a plus eleven. And it will become plus minus minus. Okay. Minus eleven into forty. Okay. So that will become. We take it this side. Nine three six zero divided by six is equal to two a minus eleven four zero forty four zero. Okay. I will cut this. Okay. You cut this. Can divide it nine three six zero by six. You cut it. Nine three six zero. Okay. You get one five six zero. So one five six zero is equal to two a minus four four two. Take it this side one five six zero equal plus four forty is equal to two a. Add it. So two a is equal to two thousand. Therefore, a is equal to two thousand divided by two. That will get thousand. Therefore, first installment is equal to a. That is equal to thousand rupees. Okay. Now we want to find the last. T two, you know the formula. T two is equal to a plus eleven d. Formula, okay. Twelve means eleven. A is thousand. Plus eleven d is minus forty. That will become thousand. Plus minus minus eleven into four 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 zero. Okay. Okay, you get five sixty rupees.
Okay, I hope you got this. Next, we'll do next problem. Important, okay. Third problem. Okay, now this is AP. Because you get common difference 2000, okay. okay. Because the common difference is equal to same, okay. Common difference is same. That is 2000, that's it. So A is equal to 5000 and common difference subtracted 7000 minus 5000, okay. 2000. Okay. What you have to find? They had given find the total investment. N is given twelve years, and you have to find S twelve is question mark. Okay, very simple. You have to just put it and get it. Okay. Formula S N is N by two. Two A plus N minus one. So S12 is equal to 12 upon 2, 2 into A is 5000 plus N is 12 minus 1, D is 2000. Cut it, it will become 6, 6 and 2 into 5, it will become 10, again 3, 0. It will become 11 and here 11 into 2. Okay, now we multiply this part. That will become 6. It will become 10,000 plus 11 into 2, 2 into 2, 1, 2, 3. Okay. Add it, okay. That will become 32. That is equal to 6 into 32 into 1000. Okay. So that's all we have to total amount investment. Okay, I hope I got this. Next, we'll do next problem. In fourth problem, they had given there are 20 seeds, 22, 24, so on. Okay, and N is given. N is 27. And we can calculate A is 20, D is equal to 22 minus 20, that is 2, okay. What do you want to find? We want to find number of 15th row, okay. T15 is question mark. And total how many seats are there, okay. I mean S27 is question mark. 15th row and how many total seats? Very simple, you have to just put this formula. T15 is equal to A plus 14D. Formula. So that is equal to A is 20, 14D is 2. So 20 plus 4 to 28, that will become 48. So T15 is 48, okay. Now you have to calculate the just 27. 48 plus 
for that we had formula S n is equal to n by 2 2 a plus n minus 1 d. We go n is 27. So, s 27 is 27 by 2 a is 20 plus it will become 27 minus 1 d is 2 it will become 27 by 2 40 it will become 26 and 2 so 27 by 2 40 plus 26 and 2 calculate okay. that to add it ok that will become 27 by 2 and to add it you get 92 that we cut it 27 into 46 that will get 1 to calculate here ok 1 to 4 2 Ok, I hope you got this. Next we will do another problem. Ok, first condition. What is the first condition? Monday temperature plus Saturday temperature with five more than mean five more mean plus okay. five more okay. five more than Tuesday and Saturday. Tuesday temperature plus Saturday. Sorry. Saturday temperature okay. okay. Monday take it as J A plus D A plus two D A plus three D A plus four D A plus five D Monday is A Saturday is A plus five D Tuesday is A plus 2, A plus D. Saturday is A plus 5, D. Plus 5, okay. Oh, you can cancel anything, okay, you can cancel that. You can cancel it. Cancel this also. 0 is equal to D plus 5. Therefore, D is minus 5. Okay. Now, what is the second condition? Temperature of Wednesday, okay. Wednesday temperature is minus 30 degrees Celsius. So, Wednesday temperature is minus 30 degrees, but that is Wednesday is A plus 2D. A plus 2D is equal to minus 30 d is minus 5, a plus 2 into minus 5 is equal to minus 30. So, a minus 10 is equal to minus 30. So, a is equal to minus 30 plus 10. So, that a is equal to minus 20. Ok. Ok, now let us calculate Monday. Monday is equal to a minus 20 degrees Celsius. Tuesday A plus D that is minus twenty minus five minus twenty five degrees Celsius. Wednesday A plus two D that will become minus twenty plus two into minus five that is minus twenty minus ten minus thirty degrees Celsius and calculate for Thursday A plus three D that is equal to minus 20 plus 3 into minus okay minus 20 
minus 15 into minus 35 degrees Celsius. The Friday is equal to a plus 4d. That is equal to minus 20 plus 4 into minus 5. That is minus 20 minus 20 minus 40 degrees Celsius. Saturday a plus 5d. Okay. So that is equal to minus 45 degrees Celsius. Okay, I hope you got that. Next, we will do next one. Okay, sixth problem. The planting the trees, okay, and triangular format. So first row one, two, three, one, two, three, four. And it's given 25. Okay. A is given 1. D is given. Add 5. This is AP. So N is 25. Then A is 1. D is 2 minus 1. 2 minus 1. That is 1. We want to find S25 is question mark. Hn is equal to n by 2, 2a plus n minus 1d. 25, S25, 25.22 into a is 1 plus n is 25 minus 1, d is 1. That will become 2, 24. That will become 25 upon 2. 2 plus it will become 26. Okay. I cut this. 22 and 13. You get 25 into 13. Calculate. Okay. Okay. I hope you got this. Next we will do one important problem. Okay. Example four. Page seventy six. See perimeter of circle two pair. Semi perimeter. This is semi perimeter. So this part is semi perimeter. That is pi r. Okay. Now perimeter 1, P1 is pi R1, okay, but that guy radius, okay. okay, so that is equal to pi into 0.5, the 0 0.5, 0 0.5 is 1 by 2, so that will become half pi, okay, that will become half pi. And perimeter 2 is equal to pi r2, that is pi into so it is given, okay. it will go on like this. So that will become 1, so that is equal to pi. Now let us calculate perimeter 3, is equal to pi into r3. Sorry, it is semi perimeter, okay. So that will become pi into 1.5. So 1.5 is 3 by 2. 3 by 2 pi. So it will go on like this, okay. Do this in rough, okay.
Okay. Now this is A P. A is this, and D is pi minus pi by two. So pi minus pi by two. Then we'll go here. Two pi minus pi upon two. Add to two pi minus pi. It is pi upon two. Okay. So that will become pi by two. I want to find thirteen thirds. N is equal to thirteen. We want to find S thirteen is question mark. Write the formula. S N is equal to N by two two A plus N minus one D. N is thirteen by two. Two into A is Half pi is equal to pi by two. Okay. So that will become pi by two plus n is thirteen. Thirteen minus one, and d is this pi by two. Okay. We cut this. Thirteen by two is equal to pi plus thirteen minus one. Twelve into pi upon two. Two into six. That will become. So it is S n means n is thirteen, so S thirteen. Okay. So S thirteen is equal to thirteen by two pi plus six pi. So thirteen by two pi plus six pi. Take it as one. One plus six seven. It will be seven pi. Okay. I think you cannot multiply to this. Okay. But you know thirteen by two. Into seven, pi is two into two by seven. Okay. So it is thirteen into eleven. That is one forty-three centimeter. I hope I got that. Next time I will do other problems.